Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Avadon 3 The Warborn. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today here in the Spiral. Yeah, that's right, that's right. We uh, came here because of Nathalie, and the last episode we also found a ghost that's apparently protecting this place. Let me just check what we have up here. Just junk. Um, and uh, last episode we fought the guys that were in here. Man, why can't I click? I was trying to click in there, but you see, I was clicking. It doesn't let me go in. Huh. Uh, and the opposite happens as well. Ah, doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so we killed a bunch of guys that were in here, and we got a bunch of loot as well, I think. But more importantly, we leveled up. Uh, so, Kalita leveled up. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna bring her dexterity. Does that... No, that's for... What's the to hit chance? Uh, what's the to hit chance on, on melee? Helps you wear heavier equipment without becoming encumbered. Makes your melee attacks hit more often. That's the one. So bring that up. Uh, we have all these ready to go. I The disarming blow is not really what I want. I have two more of these. So I'm going to go with the Path of the Shield. And I could go with another one. Because that is going to... No, actually, that doesn't matter for right now. Let's bring with this one. Because... No, actually, that doesn't really matter too much. But I do want the Path of the Berserker. Uh, because of regenerations and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, I think I think this is a pretty even tree. So yeah, let's go downstairs, and can't go there from where you are. Oh, of course I can. It's Sulik. It's Sulik that di dictates who goes where. Okay. Well, this doesn't look too much like a spiral. Suppose yeah, you you, you might not remember, but this is supposed to be the spiral, and. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look too much like one. You are at the south end of what was an enormous library. Long galleries extend to the north, each lined with bookshelves. Alas, the ceiling leaks, Natalie quickly confirms. All of these works are rotten and illegible. She is unconcerned. There were just these were all just old records, useless. The books of value will be kept somewhere secure, guarded by something like that. She points to the north. It's a long way away, but a glowing figure is... I don't see it. The glowing figure is visible in the shadows to the north. It is then joined by more shades, who drift mindlessly to the south, hunting for intruders. Natalie smiles. Excellent. Active defenses, she says. That means there is sure to be something useful here. You're not sure you entirely believe her logic. Well, yeah. A new... Uh, an icy wind blows through the galley... The gallery... More shades are hunting the corridors, and here they come. So they summon these hunting, these shades, hunting shades or hunter shades actually. They spawn, not summon. Did I say summon? I mean spawn. So let's try and kill you. Okay, that's actually they are not really that tough. And uh, I think a blessing of thorns here is gonna do good things. Vulnerability curse. That's totally fine. I got good things here for you as well, my friend. I got a, uh, what's this called? This. It doesn't do much damage, though. There it is. And I'm radiating energy. Blessing of Thorns right there. Kalita has got some energy of her own right there. Yeah, so we can, if, if as long as we don't get swarmed by, the, by many of these groups, I think we can hold even two. Hold against two, I think. Let's see what happens here with the Syrian spray. Just keep... A okay, they're immune to po to uh, to acid, though. Okay, so I that's easy to remember. Uh, another one, yeah. Okay, so that is something that we really need to be on the lookout for. Nice cleave! Uh, yeah. I don't really know what's what this means, though. Uh, does it mean that we just need to avoid them? Because if that's the... Okay, so let's summon Drake over here. Hey, Drake, what's up, man? Let's do this. That was not a kill. It wasn't going to be a kill unless a crit happened. Let's see if I can stun that thing. No. Okay. Okay, they're coming that way. So, yeah, trying to avoid them right now, I think, might be a, a good solution to this conundrum. And actually, at this point, I think we can exit combat and then try to flee this way. Let's go, Drake. Oh, boy. Okay. So, I th hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna try and bring that one down a little bit instead of this one. We're not fully healed. This is that's why the mm hmm is going on right now. It's because we're not in a good position. <laughs> this is actually 
way tougher than I was expecting. Oh, that one doesn't know we're here. That's fantastic. Uh, hot coals, can you do something over there? Uh, go right ahead. We're gonna need to go through them, but that's totally fine. Let's bring you back here. Let's uh, group heal it up right there. And then Drake can move up here and do a little bit of damage. Not a whole lot. Kalita can do much herself, but she can challenge them and start to regenerate. Those AoEs are a big deal. Yeah, so okay. So that actually isn't that bad up there. Although I would probably need some proper potions soon. I would like to have... I'm probably gonna bring Kalita over there to see if they can take uh, damage over time. Okay. Okay, they keep, they keep spawning. But here is a good position for Drake. Yeah, that guy died. It's fantastic. So I don't even need to use her abilities for that. So I just bring her up there. And uh, yeah, let's start working on this guy. Okay, that guy's gonna go through here. And only that guy is gonna take AoE. Oh! That's not great. Really isn't. But I need some resistance here. The haste didn't activate. That's okay, I can heal her up. Uh, and then Drake can go on in and can't use his ability. That's fine. I'm gonna go over there and attack through here. Kalita can not do much, but she will be able to do this. Nice. And then she will be able to attack that. Very good. Okay, that guy moved up a little bit. I probably should have thought of that. Uh, doesn't matter. Let's attack that. Okay. It's good that they're resilient to fire. They're not resilient to fire. Okay. I'm using the javelin. Shouldn't be using the javelin. Although I should... Are they... I don't know if they're immune. Okay. Oh, they haven't died yet. Okay. So I'm gonna send her up there. And I'm gonna exit combat here. Uh, and I'm gonna save immediately as well. If I can. Okay, good. They don't know what we're here. They don't, Oh, those do. Those do. Just move up to them. Oh, man. They keep spawning so fast. Whoo. And this place does look to be a pretty huge hall, as well. Uh, well, we can hold our own, I think. There's just two over here, so it's not gonna be too tricky, I wouldn't think. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save her stamina for right now. Her ability is more, more importantly, that stamina is not really the issue for her. Oh, they're immune to this. Damn it. Oh, man. They're immune to acid. That's a good thing Botan is not here with us, because he that's pretty much what he does. He throws acid, he just throws up on these guys. Uh, okay, let's go with a Blade Sweep, because that's going to kill that one and do a little bit of damage there. That's a miss, that's fantastic. Let's go with a Icy Lance right there. Okay, 33. Oh my god, that's terrible. Uh, okay, just... But I need to see if they're, they're immune to magic, because I, I should have attacked with my wand, rather than the Javelin right there. It's always good to have, uh, always good to have a backup. Okay. Okay, so... Again, uh, press F and then F3 for the saves and all that sort of stuff. Okay, good. Let's go. And here they are. Hello! How's it going? Oh boy. There's a lot of them up there. Uh, can I get this stuff? <laughs> uh, there's nothing important over there. Um, no, not that, not that. Uh, so I can do, I can do this. It's actually quite good. That guy is gonna attack Sulik though. Maybe. No, it's not. Although he did, he did have a little bit of uh, a cleave luck, unfortunately. Uh, let's go with that. Good. And then Sulik moves back, gets stopped, of course. Uh, let's try this against that guy. They're not immune, so fantastic. I'm gonna do my best, the best amount of damage. Let's go with a swift shot over there. With a critical, very nice, Kalita, very, very nice. Let's see if we can stun that guy over there. With another critical, but he resists the stun. It's not... Oh, man, that guy's still cleaving. I, I don't know very well what the rules for cleave are. Okay. It's not bad. Let's see if we can kill him. Let's see if she can kill him. I think that might be the exit. Is that the exit? Those are stairs, but they... Are they coming from here? I'm gonna save and reload later. If, uh, if bad things happen. So as soon as I exit this this battle, which I can't do right now. Oh, that's where they come from. Okay, so screw that. Let's get out of here. Let's just get out of here. Yeah. I would like to stop them or farm them. I suppose we could farm this. Let's go. Okay. Save the game. We're safe. Okay, they're still s spawning upstairs. But they even I think they eventually die, right? They must eventually. Otherwise, it would just... 
bogged down the game to no end. One of your companions grows too irritated to stay silent. Nathalie, Kalita says, I still respect the rules of Avedon. This is a lot of time and risk to break them, especially rules that make sense. Nathalie walks in silence. Eventually, she says, I can use the power here. I can use it for us. I've risked my life. For you, for all of us, this is my price. If you want to turn back, you can. If you abandon me, I will remember it. Well, I'm not gonna abandon you now. I would have abandoned you before already, not now. I mean, we're in this dip because I made the decision. Uh, let's see. Okay, there's a Venom Spray Spider. Not the most amazing enemy that I would like to find, but sure, I suppose. Okay, we're critical. Um, let's move you over there. Let's do an icy lance. Okay, well, the light is gone, and I like it, so let's just keep it over there. And uh, let's summon Drake. Right there. Which is not going to end up being the best action I can take, but it doesn't really matter. I think. Maybe. Let's move you over there. And there's only two spiders. Okay, so that's not going to be a problem. I thought there maybe would be more. I like those those sofas over there. They're more like armchairs, not really sofas, but they're, they're, they're nice. Let's do a challenge right there. You can do a searing spray. I don't think they're immune to acid. So there we go. Pretty decent. Icy Lens, if you can see them. Yes, you can. Very nice. And Drake attacks that with a cleave. Very good. Okay, they're coming down there. Okay, that's. I think that was a good decision then for keeping... Yeah. Definitely, definitely a good decision, because now I can do the I can do the challenge, but I can do something else, something good, although not much. Mm. Yeah, just two of them get hit. Do you know what this reminds me of? Okay, let's. Yeah, this reminds me of. You remember? I don't remember where it was, but there was this place where there was a bunch of. Uh, it was an interior place with a bunch of corrupted corruption uh, enemies. It's when we started to learn about the corruption, uh, and uh, they were pretty nasty. But it, it does remind me of that. 59. Come on, Drake. Can I finish the job over here? I think so. Nice. The, the sound of a searing spider. I have no idea what that sounds like. But that was... That seemed to be... That seemed to be it. So a couple of ensnared right there. Not a big deal because Kalita has mobility skills. Uh, and that's another ensnared right there. She's poisoned. That is a problem. She's corrupted. That is a big, big deal. Okay, we need to kill this thing. I think she's gonna die. There's no way she's gonna survive. I can't do anything for her right now. There she is. Ah! That's what, he, that's what she did. That's what she did. Okay, move you back over there. And uh, see if you can start killing these spiders. I think Kalita will be fine. She didn't. She just didn't have any armor. That's, that's the reason. Uh, okay. Kalita. Now a challenge would be fantastic. Because there's spiders moving in, moving in on me. And uh, I would prefer that not to be the case. And also another thing that Kalita doesn't need enchant or uh, doesn't need to be uh there it is doesn't need uh, to move because these guys just keep coming. Uh, let's see. So I'm gonna go. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Um, I could teleport. Can you teleport down there? Yeah, I think that's gonna gonna be a good a good thing. And I realize I'm in the middle of them all. But these guys are attacking Kalita, so it doesn't really matter. So that way Kalita has another turn to challenge them all, hopefully. No, she lost her turn. Did she? I think she did. Yeah, she did. <sighs> well, let's move. Let's get out. Through there. And, uh... What can you do? No, not much. Can you... Th yeah, there was a... These are all... Yeah, I, I screwed up there. I screwed up. Can't do that. I know, I know. Hmm, uh, it doesn't matter. Keep moving. Run away. See, maybe that guy's gonna... Maybe... Uh, no, yeah. That guy's not gonna do anything. <sighs> that spider in there. The Drake would be so much better. Oh, look at what she has. She has so many things. And she's holding her own. The, that Kalita is such a fantastic fighter. Okay. Okay, there it is. Kalita... Ca no, she's stunned. She's stunned again. Okay, let's see if I can kill that bastard. Okay, good. And now Drake can do this. And that's a kill, and next turn is gonna move out, and we gotta level up. I would I would say that it was uh, Nathalie that leveled up. She's losing her turns left and right. I can heal her up, and actually, Blessing of Thorns here is gonna be good. Uh, can you go? Ooh, with a cleave. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. That's the repulse right there, and... Uh, oh, 
yeah, so she lost her turn. I can heal her up at any time. So, yeah, we're in a very advantageous situation, I would say. Let's move you over there. Okay, very good. It's a bit of a, sp a spindly battle. Spindly? Or a tricky battle, I suppose. Mostly because we lost one of our teammates, but I guess it doesn't really matter at this point. So, yeah, Drake is gonna be over there. He got hasted with the cup. Man, <laughs> He just dealt a bunch of damage there, just because a haste and double cleave, that was fantastic. That was really good. Um, okay, so now Kalita does, she keeps not attacking. She can't. She basically can't. I would use a wand, but I don't think I need to, because I have a wand here myself. Look at this. Ah, still not a kill. And she's stunned still, so she's not going to have the next turn either. And, uh, yeah, she got that one. No, wait a minute, she lost her stun. Yeah, there it is. So that's a kill. So she's gonna go next turn, and you can't attack with uh, your special ability unless she gets stunned this turn. Which didn't happen, so there she is. A challenge. And then an Icy Lance over here. And then just to, uh, just to you know, contrast, a contrast of, of, of temperatures. Uh, the fire of Drake. A corruption, and a parry, and she can do this. And, nope, actually, that's not what I want her to do. Let's see if you can kill that guy. Yes, you can. And then kill this guy. Yes, you can. And she got her revenge. And she didn't. She she dead. She dead. Uh, so let's get that. Uh, what do I need? Arcane Blessing. It's always nice. Cloud of Confusion. Uh, no, let's go with Arcane Blessing. That sounds a little bit better. Quite a lot better. Even though the sound I made wasn't that good at all. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. Uh, there's nothing out here. Yeah, so... Hmm. These were not... Uh, were, maybe these were protective de devices, maybe. These spiders. Or maybe they just leave down here. Uh, this requires... Would take one lockpick. I have seven only. Man. Okay, what do we have in here? We have a potion of speed. That's okay. I can take care of that. We have coin, and that is that. We have a... Uh, Freezing bolts, uh, scroll, and we have a dagger. Not great. Of course. Of course, it was open. I was gonna say, the words just didn't come to my mouth. But I was gonna say, it was open. If we can click on something that's open, then it means secret passage. It's, it's that simple. It's that simple. So there's something up there. And uh, that secret passage was that door right there. Does this lead somewhere? The door is locked. You don't have a key, and the lock is too complicated to open, even with spells. So we have a battle rune stone over there, and that is... What do we have? We don't have battle rune? Oh, we have a couple. Yeah, we have a couple of these. Not the greatest of things, but I suppose. Okay. That's a little bit better, just so I remember where things are. Okay. Uh, was there anything else interesting? No, just trash. Okay, let's go this way. Uh, too complicated to be picked. I really didn't want to pick it. I just wanted to open it with my uh, with my spells. Of course that is. Of course that is. How did I knew that? Uh, let's go with that lovely crystal. And there's going to be no enemies back here. Fantastic. And we have... Oh, Wand of Corruption. I like that. I, I, I very much enjoy the notion and, and uh, the, the thought of that. What happened? Oh, I have it... Duh, what happened? I had them put in my hand. Uh, let's put that over there. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Put it over there. Yes. Okay, this goes into the backpack. And uh, that's that. There's nothing else over here. We're good. There's nothing else for, for it to open anyway, so it doesn't matter. We got a bit of trash, and let's continue. And I think we're about to find out what that ghost... Yes. Halia's Shade is right there. And she's aggressive. So let me save the game, and let's go up against it. That thing is going to summon things. You confront Ihalia one last time. Her ghost is standing guard just outside the core of the library. Through the closed gate, you can see sh shelves heavy with books, all organized, all intact. Halia's shade faces you. I wish you had gone. Now you will end, or I will. We both have compulsions. Only one can live. I don't have any compulsions. What are you talking about? Nobody saw me do that. Anyway... Nathalie is irritated. It doesn't matter what you are, ghost, construct, you're dead, Halia. And the war outside is very much alive. We need the power. Get out of the way! Halia has no response to this. She seems confused. Her mind lacks the ability to process Nathalie's argument. 
yeah, she might be just a, a, a construct or a ghost. I mean, the ghosts we've seen so far, they all kind of lose themselves a little bit as time goes on, and it, made, it would make sense that uh, she would be a ghost. Um, you know, if I destroy you, you'll never know who you are. That is true, alas. That doesn't bother you? No, not at all. When I was made or remade, I was not given the, avi the ability to be bothered by things. I only warn and fight. That's the ability to be bothered. That's not an ability. That's a curse, but sure. Um, why are you so determined to protect the library? It is the way I was made and the way I was in life. I am a librarian and servant of Avedon. In life and death, my orders are part of my nature now. I have no choice. Well... That's enough, Shade. Let me buy. Your intentions are clear. I must now submit entirely to my nature. I will kill you, but it is not personal. I'm not even capable of making it personal. Goodbye. Halia begins to cast a spell. The clutter and junk around the southern platform begins to assemble themselves. The crystals to the south start to glow. Yeah, they kind of were glowing already, but uh, we'll see what's going to happen. I'm going to try... I'm gonna try and position both Sulik and uh, Nathalie back here, and uh, Kalita's gonna be over here. So what she's gonna do first, I'm gonna try and kill this thing as much as, as soon as possible. She's gonna try and go for a stun. The stun got resisted. Of course it did. I wasn't expecting it uh, to go through with that, but yeah. Uh, next up, I can do hot coals, which would be a good thing, but the problem is Sulik is kind of there. But well, she's gonna he's gonna need to burn a little bit. That's that's what he has the price he has to pay. Next up, I'm gonna summon yeah Drake. Helios Shade says this is a full invasion. It is time for the final activation. Soon I will no longer exist. A moment later, with a soft popping noise, turrets appear on the platforms to the south. They swivel to aim at you. A field of force appears around Halia, shielding her. The floor around the crystal to the south begins to glow with a sickly green. It appears to be quite an assortment of defenses. Okay. Th that mean What does that mean? That she's not going to be able to take damage? Uh, these are nullity... They are, they're just an assortment. I think I know what this is, actually. Um... I think I know what the game is trying to do. We need to destroy these turrets before we get basically killed by that. No, she still takes damage. She took damage right there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so she can't move. She can't do anything. That's actually quite quite bad. Quite bad. Uh, let's attack that. No, she's not taking any damage. Is she? Okay, we need, I think we need, let's, let's, let's not do this. Let's not do this, yeah, double F4. I think we need to embrace what we are here to do. So, let's just ask everything, and there she is. Okay, so she casts her nasty spell, and that's fine. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have Kalita stay over here. And that's a little bit crazy, but I think that might be a little bit better. Next up, I am gonna have you go over there. And uh, cast Arcane Blessing. Okay. And then you can cast uh, Salamander. And then next turn... Oh, that's an interesting turn of events. That's really interesting. What? Okay. Kalida, can you do something over there without leaving that spot? I don't know what's going to happen. She is taking damage. She wasn't taking damage before. This kind of confirms it. Yeah, she wasn't taking damage before. And now that happens. Okay. So we basically lose all of our abilities. Because we're going to get nullified by that. And slowed as well. Okay. But that's not a problem. So I need to go over there. And you can stay there. It's fine. Oh, they're attacking the fire. Oh, <gasps> That's great! Although she's gonna be in a little bit of a pinch, but uh, at least now I can attack the nullity, the nullity pylon. That's the big problem right there. She doesn't have any abilities, but she will be able to do a little bit of damage. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's attack that. Oh, nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. I don't have any abilities, but I do have fantastic things. 
That's pretty much what I have. Oh my god, that thing is powerful. Look at this. Unfortunately, I think I need to move in a way that kind of doesn't make it too easy for me to aim this. Oh, no, 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 no. This is... Oh, I can't, I can't hit everybody. Can I? I think I can. Oh, I couldn't hit that one. Okay, I'm taking electrical damage. It's okay. As long as I don't get nullified again, which I probably will. But I even if I do, I got I got scrolls for this. Yeah, okay. Oh boy. Yeah, that's not going to happen right now. That's not going to happen. Oh man, I'm going to need to think of a strategy here. Either we So Yeah. Yeah. There's no way for this. Not like this anyway. So I think I think I, I I think I'm seeing this. I'm gonna have to try this off camera. But uh, what I'll think I'll do is I'll focus on Halia with the. Uh, I don't know. I don't want Kalita on top of her because otherwise Kalita's not gonna be able to get over here uh, the first turn because she gets nullified. So I want Kalita to attack her from a distance. And that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna attack them. Uh, attack her from a distance. With everybody kind of over there, and then we are all gonna go basically just crazy on on top of that thing. We are gonna need some sort of protection, however, and that is gonna be in the form of some sort of. I do have like, hmm. do I have anything here that would uh, group cure? That's a group cure, yeah. And battle blessing, salt blessing. Okay, so basically the resistance chant and the shield chant. I'm probably gonna go with this. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, I th wait a minute, she could have that, can she? No, I probably she can't. She's not gonna be able to wear, is she? No, she can't. <laughs> yeah, that would be good. That would be good, but we are out of time for the day, so I'm gonna try and check out how things go with this battle, see if I can uh, complete it, uh, like, with the strategy that I just told you, and on the next episode, I guess, uh, I'll find you here again, if you'll find me here, uh, in the middle of that battle. For now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Avadon 3, The Warborn. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video, but above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.